Bowdoin's first director of athletics, Dr. Frank Nathaniel Whittier, was honored in 1896 with the construction of Whittier Field, now part of the Whittier Field Athletic Complex. The field was developed during a period when intercollegiate sports, such as football, baseball, and track and field, were becoming more and more popular. By 1904, the complex had become so well used that temporary wooden bleachers were replaced with the Hubbard Grandstand, designed by Boston architect Henry Vaughan. In 1928, the Memorial Gate was added, a gift from the class of 1903. Whittier Field has not only contributed to the athletic education of students at Bowdoin, it was also the site of the 1972 Olympic training camp and the home track of the Olympic gold medal winner and Bowdoin alumna, Joan Benoit Samuelson. In addition to witnessing incredible history, the complex has seen major changes over time. Complementing the original bleachers, wooden and later steel ones were built around the Hubbard grandstand, hiding the fieldstone base. The paint scheme on the grandstand was changed as well. In 2017, Bowdoin College, as part of the groundwork for the rehabilitation of the track and Hubbard Grandstand, hired Sutherland Conservation and Consulting to prepare a National Register nomination for the complex. This move assisted in fundraising for the final project, which would restore the paint colors of the grandstand and move the bleachers to the opposite side of the field. As the project got underway, SCC undertook cross-section microscopy paint analysis to determine the grandstand's original paint scheme. Workers also installed new artificial turf on the field and widened and replaced the 1980s artificial track surface. A complication arose when regrading exposed several feet of the foundation below the fieldstone wall of the grandstand. SEC recommended installing compatible benches in front of the wall, which successfully screened the foundation without altering the historic structure. Bowdoin College's National Register listing and rehabilitation of the Whittier Field Complex has restored key historic elements to one of the most storied collegiate fields in America, while preparing the facility to expand and flourish well into the 21st century.